if you didn't already know I'm a different breed In my own lane and I'm in a different league When they hear me spit, they don't try to bother killing another beat Cause I'm built so differently Rappers been the A game when they spit with me Better tell them ain't a single bit of quit in me I been switching gears, hitting different speeds I don't really bark, you'll get bit with me Yo, what is up you guys? We're here for episode 4 of Moon uh, Episode 3 <clears throat> We left off with Khonshu being in prison in stone from the other gods um he told steven to tell mark to let him out when they imprisoned him oh um harold destroyed i guess like was it like a map coordinates tomb. yeah how to find it <clears throat> not the coordinates mark let steve out and then he did his thing and then Kanchu pushed the knight back all the way to that night or whatever the constellation was did it remind you of avatar when like Sokka was trying to in the library when he was trying to yeah like find the the date like the day of black sun solstice. the solstice the yeah solstice. when they would invade the fire nation or something like that that's what it reminded me of like literally turning back time like in the lost sky, yeah. <laughs> but no that's with the owl remember yeah yeah they were in the library and then Apple it's like the sand yeah <clears throat> anyways yeah um so we gotta see we gotta see now if Harold's gonna get any closer to releasing Amit and if Mark, Steven, and apparently a third personality are able to release Conchu and save him. So yeah. So is Amit like how is they trapped um Conchu? Like and that's what they're trying to find? No? I don't know. I have no idea. Maybe. Or it's in a straight up sarcophagus and it's a different like You're right. I don't know. But we shall see. So anyway. Don't forget to like this video, comment down below, subscribe, and let's get into this episode four here. It's called The Tomb. Also, real quick, uh, I've seen a lot of like rumors and speculation on social media of Mark Ruffalo and the Hulk being in Moon Knight. Mm -hmm. That would be so cool. Because <laughs> I feel like long. they yeah, I feel like they have to show a little cameo of somebody who's already in the MCU just to like really make it feel connected, you know? But probably that won't be till like episode 6 or the finale or something. But anyways, alright, let's go. Who's this? Oh boy. <laughs> they just walk up to him. Now he's dead. <laughs> That's so cool. I feel like Mark is the original first personality anyway. Oh, hadn't, hadn't they disappeared from your life already? <laughs> I mean, suit was his best feature, wasn't it? It's just you and me and the open road. Are we going from here? Yeah. Yeah. Door? Floors go. <laughs> Oh, camels! I like camels. It reminds me of Scorpion King with the rock. Ooh. Camels are smarter. Horses are faster, but camels are smarter. I've got Layla. She's got my back. Oh, you, you loved? Are you in love with my wife? I appreciate you doing that, mate. I really you do. You lay one finger on me. It's not a recipe for a protein shake or something. I'll call you. Off a cliff. This is so weird. <laughs> that is funny. Oh, whose blood is that? Hey, hey, hey. You smell like him. Well, he is him. I mean, why wouldn't you, right? <laughs> Mark's trying to protect you from Conchu. That's why he's been pushing you away. He thinks Conchu wants you for his avatar and he won't let that happen. Damn. Hey, 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 hey. Being, uh, honesty? Doesn't be awkward. <laughs> Steve has never done that before, has he? 
that bad, huh? We see Angelina Jolie, Laura Croft, Tomb Raider come out. That. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> what? Mark, Mark. What's that? <laughs> Steven actually must be like geeking out right now because he. He is. Look at him. Yeah, he knows all this stuff. He studies this stuff. So this is actually exciting for him. Gecko. <laughs> Fellas, don't date archaeologists, girls. They love digging up old. <laughs> I'm telling you, man, they're gonna run up on Black Adam. Wrong universe. It's amazing. It's amazing. It's the tongue. The avatar would be on its voice. Oh, well. is that fresh blood? Mm-hmm. Chunks of baby bits. Because of the goats. Oh, yeah. They're sacrificing. Oh. Yeah. Something just died. Just a minute. Uh, uh, snakes. Self regeneration. Oh, uh, what is that? I'm in. Ew, what is that? Don't, don't, just, just. Ah! He's right there. Oh! That's gross, man. Oh, hey. <laughs> that is disgusting. Stomp its fingers. Oh. Go! Yeah, that was gross, man. We didn't even really see it. I know. I was just, I was trying not to. Look. Oh, you almost died. <laughs> ah, it's like watching that um Tomorrow War, the the, the clicking. Hmm. Or you know when Hawkeye in Endgame shot the flare arrow, you saw all the, oh. the Chitauri aliens and the dogs and stuff. <laughs> yeah. Steven's not gonna be able to walk across that now. Why did they split up, you know? Because she was at the bottom and there was a thing. Oh, she should have. Yeah. <laughs> ah. yeah. Oh my god. Oh no. What the hell? Wait, what? Come on. Oh, oh, oh. oh is she fighting this? Ew. That made it worse. How did she fight it off in there? Hey, somebody. Push it! Push it off the ledge! Push it off the ledge! Oh, yeah, there you go. Oh, God, you too! Did it grab her? Yeah, I've never felt like uh, watching anything Marvel until <laughs> now. How did she fight it off in the pitch black? She didn't even know she grabbed the hand. She's like, ah! How did just survival instinct kick in? She was just grabbing stuff and hitting stuff. I'm it. Harold. Harold. You kissed her. <laughs> what are you gonna do? Try and drown this now? Yeah, I should. That was unexpected. Yeah. Oh, wow, look at that. <laughs> you just brush it off. Yes. Yeah. Go ahead. I want to know what the 
Where is yours? Because they have two missions, right? Stop Harrow. Save country. Save country. Inside the body? In its head. Alexander's the voice. In its throat. On it. Sorry. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Mr. Gray. Great. <laughs> Whoa! Imagine what it smells like. Yeah, let's go, buddy. Close it. <laughs> I'd like to thank the Academy. And the Shanti goes to us. And the Shanti goes to Alexander. What happened to my father? Oh, not now. This is not the time. I'm talking to you. I'm talking to Mark. Mark Ruffalo. Oh, hi, Mark. Mark, we have to go home right now. Stop. What? Stop. You need to leave right now. I will explain everything. I swear. Oh. I will go. Of course not. Of course I didn't. Okay, go and then explain on the way. How did he die? He executed everyone on this side. Who's his partner? No, but I didn't die. Can't you save me? Should have went. Yeah, now you want to go. <laughs> like he could have explained that to you outside. Okay, who has Ahmed? So no conch, no suit. Shanti's dragon comes out. <laughs> that transition is sick into a flashlight. Oh, what is this? The screen even changed. Mm -hmm. It's a flashback. It's a young Harold. Does this mean Twitter's gone too? You're Dr. Stephen Grant. This is what Steen's personality is based off of. Mm. Now let's see what we can find on our friend here. E22, everyone. Is he in a mental hospital? E22. Hey, that's the one that broke into his house, remember? What is going on? Huh. That's the guy Layla fought. Is that the one that made the passports? Maybe. Is this even real or is this in someone's head? Go fish. Right to the man. Breaks around your favorite spot. Layla. It's been five times this week. It's a lot. Yeah. I won. We have a winner. Shit, it's time, I swear. Mm. A Moon Knight action figure. Is this when um, Sylvie stabbed? He who remains, everything got messed up. Great deal of difficulty being able to differentiate. She's a doctor. <laughs> I like the villain. But remember, you're only sedated because of your own behavior. I work in a psych hospital, so this is like. Live in a material world, a psychic world. This pen, right? To me, this is a writing utensil. To my dog, it's a chew toy. Is he in a coma? 
is an honest assessment of your situation. Are they still in Egypt? This is like an illusion. To the nucleus. You know when Sylvie was doing that to the girl? He's in the pyramids, though. Look, listen, I know you stay away from me. Come on. Steven. Steven. Those two are locked away. It's the third personality who's, oh, oh. who's out right now. Oh, 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 he's about to come out. He's gonna, they're gonna bring out the third personality. He's gonna bust out of here. No, come on. We wanna see him. Let him out. Or the third personality is already in control, breaking out, and they're inside. What? Don't end. There's gonna be something. Oh, oh my gosh. <clears throat> Yo, my brain can't handle this is in right pain. Now. Okay. Let that digest for a second. Um. Okay, so I'm assuming after he got shot, obviously he maybe blacked out for a bit. And then, doll in his head. And then he started to come to with that illusion or whatever. And then that's when everything started to click. Obviously everything was symbolic. Like he's probably still in the pyramid. You know, just everything from Harold's outfit to the his crew to the way the hospital was set up you know like had the statues on the desk but it's obviously statues in the pyramid i think that's all in his head he's still in the pyramid about to come back to consciousness or something yo or like i said steven kiss layla they got layla got attacked by that thing he found Ahmed. he got shot mental health a lot happened in this episode yeah we were we don't even know like really what that was that creature it's a god that mummy looking oh. thing that thing. I mean, it wasn't. Hi. It wasn't wrapped like a mummy. Oh no, not the hippo. Thing. I think that might have been like a, like a priest. Um, no, but what was it doing? You know, like with the harvesting the uh, body parts. Archaeologist. Or like, I don't know. It's some sort of ritual. They put um, their intestines in, in, in a jar, and they bury the mummy with it. I mentioned I this. Think, I'm not sure. I mentioned this earlier in the episode, but. <laughs> I think this next phase of Marvel, they're gonna tap in more of like the, <clears throat> like the creepy, slightly horrorish vibes because no MCU related project has ever made me feel like like this yet. Yeah. But I know for a fact, possibly Doctor Strange too will. So, I think that's the direction they're going. Um, Obviously, like we we seen in the Doctor Strange two trailer, like zombie one and stuff. So I think that's where they're headed. I'm gonna rewatch this, but I don't. I'm gonna rewatch this later in the dark on my phone. <laughs> yeah. So my my thing is like when they passed that one room and there was that other tomb shaking. Was third that the personality? Th the third personality, or is the third personality already like he already kicked in and he's in control, breaking them out right now? Well, those two Maybe are not. He's in. still in the sarcophagus. No, but we don't know for sure that's him. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying, what if he's already out and Mark and Steven are inside while he's handling it, fighting Harold again? Is that where they go when the other one switches? <laughs> I don't know. I, I work in two um, psych hospitals, behavioral health, mental health hospitals. So that was really like, yeah, you know? That's what we do it. But, um... <sighs> Toweret, Toweret. That's the god that we just saw. 
the hippo guy? Goddess. Goddess of. Goddess of childbirth and fertility. Protected. Uh, Tawaret. Tawaret. Is the protective ancient Egyptian goddess of childbirth and fertility. Her name means he, sh- she who is great. What's the name of the hippo in Madagascar? <laughs> Lilo. Is it? Gloria. <laughs> Gloria. I, f- I felt like the mission in this episode was to one stop Harrow from releasing Amit, two release and save Kanchu. And we didn't really do either <laughs> in this episode. They found Amit. They found Amit, but Harrow showed up. So both missions are still currently mm, not done. Ending. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. That was a really good episode. I'm just annoyed at how they ended it. But I mean, that's that's what they do, you know. Yeah. They, they gotta keep you wondering on the edge of your seat and wanting more. Ugh. Okay. I guess we just gotta wait till next week. And I already know, like this year, like a lot of people for Halloween are gonna be Moon Knight and Mr. Knight. Like I already know. You, you know it's gonna happen. That'd be cool. That'd be cool. Well, yeah. Thank you guys for watching this reaction. Uh, don't forget to like this video, comment down below, follow us on social media, links are down below. Check out my music, check out my podcast, and we'll see you guys next week for episode five. Oh, we're almost done. Two more. It's six episodes. Yeah. Uh, all right. <clears throat> see you guys.